Oh, is that funny? <laughs> okay, hot shot. <laughs> all over the country, at all different hours of the day, people are working. They're working, they're working. You're probably working as you watch this video right now. But have you ever stopped to think, what are they actually doing? Like, what does it feel like to do what they do? I'm Aaron Burris, welcome to Job Hoppers. Job 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 Today we're in LA meeting Carter, a cybersecurity engineer. It sounds mysterious. I don't know what they do, but I'm gonna find out today. It's 6 30 in the morning, so shh. Hello, it's Aaron from Job Hoppers! Hi. Hey! Good morning. Carter! Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh Hello. My. This is Carter, cyber security engineer. Good morning. You want some coffee? I also yes, have a please. bunch of little fruits if you'd like Ooh, something. Ooh, thank you, thank you, thank you. So if you don't mind me asking, how old are you? I'm 24. How long have you been doing it? Cyber security, a little bit less than a year. Is there any like physical training involved with like security? No, no, not no. quite. Coffee? Yeah, drink oh. it. It's strawberry flavored. <gasps> Strawberry coffee? Mm-hmm. We like fruits in this house. <laughs> so besides an amazing breakfast, what is the next thing for Carter? I gotta get dressed first. <laughs> I will see you in a second. I will keep drinking this amazing coffee. A little bit for the plants and a little bit for me. Strawberry coffee. When did that become a thing? Are you uh, ready to trabajo? Oh, goodness. You get it? Because in Spanish, it means to I, work. I do. I do get it. Yeah. <laughs> you right. ready to go? Yes. All Let's right. do it. Wait. Wait, do you work from home? Yes, I do. It's efficient, and I get a lot done. Plus, my offices are in Nebraska and in Denver, so that would oh. be a hellish commute. So who do you work for exactly? I work for Nelnet, which is a Nelnet. company that services student loans. They do. Nelnet. 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 I keep your personal information out of the hands of people that want to use it to hurt you. That's cool. You might have noticed this thing here. It tracks my steps and I get a small stipend for steps that I take. I take like 14,000 a day. I'm also training for a half marathon and so this is helpful for that. I have another one if you want to try it. Hmm. I'm starting to realize that interviewing Carter is going to be a lot harder than I thought. So how often do you talk to people? Like, do you talk to your teammates all the time? I talk to them pretty often. Oh. In fact, I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven meetings today. What? Uh, it's very important that we take advantage of our goals and benefits and all that, so. So what, what else do we have on here? <gasps> did I just hit 20,000 steps you, today? You did not hit 20,000 steps. Ooh. All right, I've heard so many things about firewalls. What is a firewall? It's it keeps the malicious threat out of our network entirely. So let's say someone's breaching the firewall. How do you know it's, like, do you have sirens that go off? Or kind like, of. Okay, like top five common things that you have to watch out for. I, every day, open up a few different types of consoles and look for, you know, weird items, weird traffic coming through the firewalls. That's something that takes up a lot of my time. Ooh. If something does not meet the requirements set by the federal government for their security, I address those. I'm always concerned about phishing. I'm always concerned about like, you know different types of people downloading malware or malicious software. Not like that. Okay. There's bait in an email. Oh, you won this gift card. And I think there's a lot of people that look at those and are like, I would never fall for that. So they're not real? You don't really get a... The gift card? Not. You do not. Yeah. Yeah, it's sad. Tell us about a situation where you had to like, hop into action. <laughs> we had a person that, oh my goodness, you doing okay? Yeah, I'm great. You do this every day? Yeah. When our security team notices some kind of malicious traffic coming in from an IP address, mm -hmm. they put in a request to me. I look at it, I, you know, analyze it, and then I, you know, I push it forward in the process and I make sure that it actually happens so that way we, we are blocking the people that are trying so hard to get in. So, what's the worst possible thing that could happen? Ransomware with no backups or anything. That's when a malicious actor, a malicious person, gets into your network and they say, you gotta give me this amount of money for me to release your data back to you. And 
the only way to actually kind of remediate that is to have a backup of your data that's really recent or keep them out in the first place. But if it's already happened, then you're kind of screwed a little that bit. That is sad. It's, it is really sad. All right, so what's next? We're going to lunch. I like lunch. <sighs> So what does a cybersecurity engineer eat? Or is it like top secret? Well, not really, but I am a vegan. Oh, cool. Did you know that when you first started getting into the tech field that, hey, I want to be cyber security engineer? I went to school for animation, and I discovered that I really wasn't that good of an artist. <laughs> oh, is that funny? <laughs> yeah, okay. But that's totally fine. I found another skill, and that skill was computers. I worked for the Geek Squad. Then I was the systems administrator for a company. All of those things were critical to my life. So let's get to the Google Career Certificates. What part did that play in where you are today? I still go back to the concepts that I learned basically every single day. When did you get it? I, I think I got it like two-ish years ago. I did it very, very slowly. I went back and I rewatched those videos several times over until yeah. the information really started sticking. Would you say it helped you kind of have like a bargaining tool to like get paid more? I mean, it, it did. My first help desk job was at the Geek Squad and I used it to leverage part-time to full-time and a small raise if I remember correctly. So uh, there's no chance of anyone ever hacking you. I wouldn't say that. <laughs> Do you feel like you're contributing to society in like a certain way? I think so. I've seen people lose money. I've seen people lose connections. The preventative work that I do could prevent somebody down the line from having like an incident that shatters their entire life. You're basically a superhero behind the scenes. Which is flattering. I have a very free life outside of my job. I do some mutual aid with a group called LA Neighbors for Neighbors. And this job gives me the money where if somebody needs to go to the doctor and doesn't have insurance, I can just pay that out of pocket. You do a lot for being 24. I do do a lot of stuff and sometimes I get a little bit tired, but I think that I've struck a really good balance recently and I think that I'm getting a lot of really good work done and I feel like I'm learning something every day and that's a feeling that I really value in my work. All right, let's cheers. Acai bowl cheers. <laughs> okay. That's a thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna play a little trick on Aaron and his cybersecurity friend to really see if they are keeping the world safe from hackers like me. You said you like animals, right? You love animals? Yes, I love animals. I mean, I've seen so many people with dogs all over the place. It's a dog park right next to my house. <gasps> Knocking on everybody's doors. FBI. Or the FBI. Oh, I love this. Not so fast, cybersecurity expert. And Aaron, I have your courtyard, and you no longer have access to your home server. Ronnie, what are you doing? Let's put Aaron's mind where his mouth is. Prove that you can make it through my hacker maze, or you're sleeping outside tonight. Not again. You've got 60 seconds. Go to checkpoint one. Finally, Listen. your package has arrived. Or has it? Do you remember ordering it? Should we open it or not? <laughs> Fail. Carter, tell him what he did wrong. Oh my gosh. We got to look at this. That is not a real email address. Oh, this is what this you're is talking This is not from the real about. USPS. You're a hacker, so you're fishing for my information. OK, checkpoint two, firewall. <laughs> you thought your server was secure? Think again. You left some ports open. Try to stop me from logging into your firewall and wreaking havoc. Find the different ports and block them with the matching ball. Go! Balls? Ah! Oh, you're helping me. Okay. You, these, this is you. Parker, don't help us all You got the green one, here's the yellow one. Ah! Here's the red one. Go match them. I'm trying. <sighs> 10 seconds. What? Back to the checkpoint, back to the checkpoint. Good job. <laughs> Next, checkpoint three. All right, Veronica the hacker, let's play. Hackers are trying to impersonate Carter. Prove that Carter is Carter by answering these questions. First question, what is Carter's favorite coffee flavor? Um, what is half a thing? Strawberry. Correct. Next question, where is Carter from? Staten Island. Oh, good job. So last question, what was their first job attack? Um, Geek Squad. You did it. I'm 
closer! 30 seconds! <laughs> okay, hotshot. Time to unveil the final round. It's a ransomware attack. Your server has been scrambled and your whole environment has been compromised. You either pay me a million bucks or decrypt it yourself. Go! I don't... Ah, come on! Do you... Hurry up! Hurry up! Do you have a million dollars? I do not have a million dollars. Yeah. Carter, come on. <laughs> To do. Better pay up. Aaron, pause. It's not worth the time. I have a backup secondary location. Saving the day. You did it. You defeated the hacker. <laughs> Balloons. Oh, this is why I wear the helmet. <laughs> oh my goodness. You both defeated the hacker. Please follow me. <laughs> Accept these cookies. Oh. Cookies! Thanks. Carter, you are truly a cyber expert. You can now go back to your home. <laughs> cool. Carter, seriously, thank you so much for having us here today. Is there anything you want to tell any future cyber security engineers? Well, learn how to learn, be curious about things, learn the fundamentals and get really, really good at them because you're going to need to know everything about how to keep somebody out. And watch out for hackers. Named Veronica. So, you want to hang out, or? I, I got some work to do. Oh, oh. Here, you. Please take the cookies. Oh, thank you. Enjoy them. Mm -hmm. Okay. When are you going to lose the microphone? Oh, my god. I'm keeping this forever. No, no, mm-mm. Aaron Burris, cybersecurity engineer. Now, that sounds really cool, but honestly, I'd probably upset a lot of people. And you know what? Carter's got it handled. But let's go check out the next job, because you're watching Job Hoppers. Job hoppers, job hoppers, job hoppers! <sighs> job hoppers!